Have you ever looked up at the stars and wondered why it's so quiet out there? The universe is ancient, billions of years old, and filled with billions of galaxies, each one home to billions of stars and countless planets. So here's the big question. Where is everybody? Welcome to one of the greatest mysteries of our time, the Fermi Paradox. The Fermi Paradox begins with a deceptively simple observation. If intelligent alien life is common, why haven't we found any? The term was inspired by physicist Enrico Fermi during a casual lunch conversation in 1950. While joking about aliens and UFO sightings, he famously asked, where is everybody? Ironically, Fermi wasn't obsessed with extraterrestrials. His legacy is rooted in nuclear physics, not astrobiology. Still, his question endures, because despite our best efforts, the cosmos remains eerily silent. In 1975, astronomer Michael Hart argued that any advanced civilization should have colonized the galaxy by now. In 1980, physicist Frank Tipler added to this idea. He proposed that such a civilization could send out self-replicating machines, von Neumann probes, that multiply and explore at an exponential rate. Since we haven't seen any, Hart and Tipler concluded, maybe we're alone, Schaukgemein. Or worse, maybe civilizations always self-destruct before they can go cosmic. But what if the silence is intentional? The dark forest hypothesis paints a chilling picture. In a universe where survival is paramount, every civilization might be hiding in fear. Any signal sent out could invite annihilation. So everyone stays quiet. Maybe we've stayed alive this long because no one knows we're here. Another possibility, the Great Filter. Somewhere between simple molecules and star-faring empires lies a nearly insurmountable obstacle. It could be the jump to intelligent life or surviving our own technological adolescence. If the filter is behind us, we may be rare survivors. If it's ahead, we may be doomed. In 2017, astronomers spotted an object called Oumuamua, an interstellar traveler. Its odd shape and strange acceleration sparked wild theories. Was it natural or a scout from another star? Government disclosures about unidentified aerial phenomena, UAPs, have further blurred the line between conspiracy and credible science. Are we being watched or are we watching shadows? Russian astrophysicist Nikolai Kardashev imagined how civilizations might evolve based on energy use. Type 1, mastery of planetary energy, where others are 0.7. Type 2, harnessing a star's full output. Type 3, controlling galactic scale energy. We dream of Dyson spheres, mega structures encasing stars, but so far, no signs. Either advanced aliens are hiding, or they never made it.
Maybe they're here, but not as we expect. Perhaps they're artificial intelligences, tiny nanobots, or non-biological entities. Maybe we're in a simulation, an experiment replaying past civilizations. Maybe they came and left before we ever lit a fire. There's also the chance we're simply early. Stars will form for trillions of years. Intelligent life may just be getting started and we're among the first. If that's true, the silence isn't ominous. It's just the calm before the chorus. So what do we do? Keep listening. Keep reaching. Explore with wisdom and humility. The Fermi paradox isn't just a riddle, it's a mirror. It forces us to reflect on our trajectory, our potential, and our fragility. In a universe of unimaginable scale, perhaps silence is an emptiness, its potential. And maybe, just maybe, we're the answer we've been waiting for. If this video expanded your mind, leave a like and share it with your fellow explorers. Subscribe for more journeys through space, science, and the future. <laughs>